Hi again, YouTubers. So this is a combined review of a Feline Eye Coal by MAC, which is a limited edition re-promote that was promoted with the D Squared collection. And from what I understand, it is coming back out in December again. And this is kind of one of those liners that you hear everyone talking about and saying how amazing it is and how great it is. Um, and I've been asked to compare it, but I also wanted to do a review on the Stila Eye Coal Codgel, whatever, in Onyx. Um, and then I'm also throwing two more in there just to kind of give you an idea. Now, when I bought Feline, I was kind of like, okay, I wanted to know what the hype was. I own Smolder, which is their, I guess, permanent version of a black eyeliner. And I had purchased the Steel Eye Codgel after watching um, Magic Girl 11 or 111's um, videos where she used this a lot. And I gave it another try, and I actually really love it. Uh, it's a super, super, super soft crayon that I've already pencil uh, sharpened a uh, couple times. This is a super, like, look how lately I'm putting that. I'm, like, just barely dragging that across my hand, and it is super, super pigmented. Um, the good and bad of this Kajal liner is that it smudges. So you either need to set it with a powder or... Um, just be prepared that it is going to smudge someone on you. I'm not too, I don't find it too bad. I have it on right now on my waterline, um, and I did, I did the top and the bottom. And I seem to find that it's really nice. It lasts well for me, and it does kind of run or move, I guess, a little bit down into your lash line, but it's nothing horrible. I tend to just take an angled brush and like carbon or a dark color and set it on my bottom waterline and that doesn't happen for me any longer. Um, but I really like this one. So when I got Feline, I was like, oh, it's going to be the same thing. Now, if I barely touch it, same thing again, put it across my hand. It is very black, and I'm hoping this lighting is helping this time because I have a light down in front of the camera now. Um, but what I find is, is this is the feline pencil is a little bit harder uh, than the Stila. So when you put it on, like you can go over a couple times and it'll coat it very perfectly and it is a true black. However, it is not as soft. So if you are nervous about lining your waterline, um, this one is a good option, but if you're concerned about it and don't want to hardly touch your eye, um, this one takes just a slight bit more. And then I have Smolder, which is an eye coal as well. And when I run it across very lightly, you can see how their stage is going lower. Okay, the Stila being the darkest, the Feline, and then the Smolder. Uh, if you can't get feline, I think Smolder is a great option. I'm not like, oh my gosh, I have to run out and get another feline before they run out. Um, and I'm just going to show you another option, which is um, by L'Oreal, and it is their Le Col Pencil in Onyx. Now, this one as well reminds me more of like Smolder. Similar in color. I will say this. Um, this one stays very well. The L'Oreal one stays very well on my waterline, but um, it doesn't like smudge down into my waterline, but I do have to reapply that one and smolder more often than I do Feline or Onyx. Um, so of these two, this is always available. This is a limited edition re-promote that has been available now. Um, it's definitely a great product. Um, I think if you are a true MAC enthusiast, Go out and get this if you're not interested in Stila or if you had the Stila. Because I had Stila once before, guys, and I returned it because I just was like, it's way too soft and was too runny. But that was before I thought about setting it. And um, sometimes I set it, sometimes I don't. Um, tonight I set it um, because I'm going out. But um, I definitely think both of these are very, very good products. Fairly similar in cost, I think. They're both in the 20s, I think, like low 20s, I think. 22, maybe. I'm not even... Honestly, you'd have to check Mac's, Mac's website and like Sephora or Stila or Ulta for this one. Um, sorry, I thought I knew the prices. I guess I don't. But just to give you another outlook, you have your Stila, Feline, Smolder, and L'Oreal. 
all great options. Um, I definitely think Feline is a really nice liner if you don't own it and you own Smolder, you don't have to run out and get it. Um, if you have the Steel Eye Cajal, again, you don't have to run out and get the Feline. So I hope you found this review helpful. Again, since this is limited edition, um, I want to make sure I get it up. But again, this one is coming back out in December. So uh, if you're interested in December, now you'll have the information. So I hope you found this review helpful. If you have any additional questions, please post them below. Thanks so much for watching, guys, and have a great day. Bye.